What's going on everybody? This is Brian from sneakerfiles.com. Today we're going to show you a closer look at the Nike Air Penny 4 Retro that is expected, well it was expected to drop during 2017. However, a few retailers are starting to get them a bit early. Uh, one of them being Chic Shoes. Link in the description below. And retail price is set at 160 I know this might not be a lot of your guys' style. I personally like them a lot. Um, but to be honest, I know they're going to drop in price, but I'll get into that in a bit. But bringing you a bit closer. So across the uppers, we actually have suede. Predominant black throughout. And then we have royal accents, which as you can see, kind of hit the side and around the heel. We also have tumbled leather that overlays as well, done in black. All black through the midsole. And then across the tongue, we have tumbled leather and we have pennies, one cent branding. And then penny again across this in the ankle strap, which... I'll undo for you guys real quick so just kind of if I can get it undone slides through like that and then once again so I'm pretty sure but let me double check while I got you guys on camera that it does not remove but I could be wrong um nope doesn't remove but as you can see, it is fully exposed and the tongue itself is tumbled leather, um, elastic right here. And also the laces are kind of tucked away, which I think is kind of nice. But I actually kind of like the laces too, the black and blue hits. All black on the inside. And then I did pull out... The insole, all black, once again, air, and the swoosh done in blue. All right. So on the medial side, you can also see the swoosh is embroidered in royal. At the heel, we got the penny branding, and then that's done in black, but the backdrop is, again, in royal. Kind of dope, in my opinion. I actually like that the penny branding, the location of it being on the hill like that and you can peep the air unit all right so let's go to the sole we got that icy outsole the hit of carbon in the middle then blue throughout and the penny branding once again so to me um i actually think these are really dope let me pull this away because this little strap i'm not going to redo the strap just now because it's going to take a minute um to me i actually think these are dope um <clears throat> the craftsmanship is not not great at all um you're going to see a lot of glue stains of course um it even looks like it, there's wet marks in certain areas because of the glue and then again it is coming on like the air unit right here and it's going to be like that throughout a lot of them. So if you do want to pick them up and like, look at that, there's like glue marks on the suede itself. But if you do want to pick them up, I like I always do, I suggest um, checking your pairs out. You just got to do it. I thought this was a little button here because to be honest, I, I have, I haven't owned the penny, the penny force at all. The, um, I've seen them in the past on shelves, like way, way, way back in the day. So, I also got this little hang tab, or the heel tab right here. It's got air across it. So, a lot of little interesting things to the shoe. It's There's no hype for them, really, to be honest. It's going to be a general release at all Nike sportswear retailers, and um, they will go on sale. But now, let's jump to the on feet.
All right, everybody, so that was your closer and on feet look at the Nike Air Penny 4 Retro, known as uh, Orlando Magic Away or just Black and Royal. Now, there is not a specific release date. These are one of those shoes that just kind of show up to Nike Sports or retailers whenever they do. But, like I stated earlier, it was expected to drop like in 2017, probably in January, which we're not far away from anyways. So, um, Chic Shoes had them early. Link in the description below. I was able to pick up this pair and to show you guys. So, overall, the craftsmanship is just not there. Once again, there's glue stains. It's not terrible, but at the same time, it's not great either. So, um, it is what it is. But you're going to have to double check your pairs if you're purchasing in person. And there's really no hype for them. So, if this isn't something you want right away, then I definitely would wait on them. And you find them in outlets probably down the road. Uh, pretty discounted prices so retail is 160 so it's not so bad i forgot what the penny two is going for but i i do like the penny two i think that is probably my favorite of like the the penny signature line i even like the penny two i think more than the foam posit again that's just my opinion i'm kind of tired of foams to be honest but um i hope to have the the orlando magic home also uh, but we'll see about that. Um, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think of these. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to sneakerfiles.com. And if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe.